For the first time in more than a half century, streetcars are moving again in Washington. I'm Martin DeCaro, the transportation reporter for WAMU 88.5. Oh, they just tested the emergency brake on the new streetcar. This is a 15 mile an hour test of the streetcar system here at the Anacostia test track. These are not the uh, streetcars of, of yesteryear. They're very quiet, um, mostly due to the electric motors, so they don't have a, a, a diesel engine or combust internal combustion engine that make noise like buses or um, truck, you know, trucks or tractor trailers. All right, we're outside the streetcar now here at the Anacostia test track. As you can see, it's a really long vehicle, about the length of an articulated metro bus. And testing is going to wrap up in about two weeks. At that point, streetcar operators will come down here to the test track and begin training how to use these vehicles. DDOT hopes to bring them over to H Street this fall, where more testing will proceed. And then, pending federal approval, DDOT hopes to begin revenue service for the city's first streetcar service in decades at the end of this year, possibly early next year.